these are the gas sensors in the clean room hallway. This is the sensor for the SATs. There are three gases which are monitored by this first sensor. This is ammonia, NH3, and it shows that there are zero parts per million in the SATs. The next reading is for oxygen. It shows that there, are, that there is 20.6% oxygen in the atmosphere in the SATs. The next sensor detects silane, which is at zero parts per million. The same sensors will indicate the gases present in three areas. This next area, the second one down, is for the gas cabinets inside of the cleaner. The gas cabinets have silane in them, as well as ammonia, NH3. The third sensor is the conduit double wall. The gas lines are the conduits and they're double walled. There are sensors within those, between the two walls, which will indicate if there is a gas leak from the first conduit to the containing conduit. We can see that this is NH3 and zero parts per million. Silene, zero parts per million. Next, we have the alarm for the N2O. It is detected in three zones. The three zones are room 16220-4, 220-3, and 16205, which is the gas bottle room. These two cabinets have to be checked before any entry into any of the clean room zones. Any alarm status will change the red light on the left, the green light on the left, to a red light on the right. The same is true for the N2O alarm adjacent to it. Further, if any of the sensors detect abnormal amounts of gas, the flashing blue lights in three different zones will be activated along with a honking alarm system.